What's good YouTube, Ben here. Welcome to the next video on the channel. In this one, I'm gonna show you how to change to a custom theme on OBS Studio. Let's get into this. Hey guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, please, because they really do help me to get found. Don't forget to turn on notifications to be notified of all uploads and live streams, and don't forget to join me on my socials. Those are all linked down below. Okay, let's get in. All right, so being able to use custom themes on OBS is really cool. It allows you to just customize your OBS to the way you want it. Um, for this, you're going to need a few things. One, you're going to need OBS Studio installed. Two, you're going to need to know where your OBS local files are saved, because you need to put something in a folder. And three, you're going to want this website. So this will be linked in the description below, beneath my links. Don't forget to follow me on those. But this website is pretty safe and it allows you to download themes for your OBS. So let's find one that looks cool. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Let's go with DaVinci Resolve. There we go. So DaVinci Resolve is a video editor, but this will allow you to change your theme. So once you're on the, the, the theme page, whichever one you want to get, hit download. That's going to then download and we're going to open up the folder. When you open up the folder, you'll find there's two files in there, DaVinci Resolve folder and DaVinci Resolve.qss. So keep this um, file explorer open and we're going to open up another one to find our files. So we'll go open a new one. And if yours is just a local exe install of OBS, follow along. So go to your hard drive, go to program files, scroll down until you reach OBS Studio, then open the data folder and open the OBS Studio folder and in there you will see themes so this is all the these are all the themes that are locally installed and as you can see these are the ones that are already can pre-installed in obs acri dark light ratchety and yammy so my version of obs i've currently got is using the yammy theme because it's the one that it starts with so once you've found your files what you want to do is just drag and drop these two into this folder Quick intermission guys, did you know that only 11.3% of you are subscribed to the channel? Don't forget to hit that sub button down below because it would really help us grow. Thank you. So we'll hit uh, just for current items, hit continue. It might ask for administrative privileges. So once those are copied, all you want to do is quickly just go into your OBS, hit settings. And then you're going to want to go to general and then hit theme. And as you can see, the DaVinci Resolve theme appears. Hit apply, hit OK, and there we go. That's changed our OBS theme to look like DaVinci Resolve. It's really cool, actually, and there's a lot of different themes on there, so I'd highly recommend checking out the website. So if you did like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on notifications to be notified of all uploads and live streams because I do upload daily in the live stream most days. Whenever I go live, I either go live here on YouTube or I go live on Twitch. So don't forget to join me on both platforms to be notified of when I go live. Don't forget you can also join my other socials like Discord down below. And don't forget you can also become a channel member from as little as 99 pence per month here in the UK or about $1.30 in America. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.